Oh, hello. You're wondering why I'm eating a raw cabbage? Well, I'm glad you asked. Here's why. Had web programming this morning. That was kind of a pain. Now I'm gonna go have breakfast. Today is Thursday, and on Thursdays we have convocations. And this particular Thursday, we're having speeches from the people who are running for certain essay offices, so we know who to vote for. And it kind of sounds like I'm rambling right now, but I'm bringing this to a point. I think you should be interested in the politics of the area that you're in. Pay attention to the race and, and put your educated vote in, because if you don't vote, you have no right to complain when things go wrong. At least if you voted for the person who didn't win, you can at least say, like, I told you so. But if you did nothing and you're like, this situation is terrible, they're gonna ask you, well, did you vote for the other person? And you're gonna be like, no. And then you're gonna look stupid because, because that is stupid. You <laughs> just, just vote. Be a good citizen. That's what you need to do. That man, there we go. My fellow students. My name is Moses Meyer. And I was the kid on the hoverboard. I am a film major and I am a freshman. Which, by the way, is vital. I want to do interdepartmental convocations. And picture this with me. A Polynesian themed luau with a fire dancer. To help raise money for the Flint, Michigan water situation. And I believe that together we can accomplish this through student engagement and community impact. Thank you very much. Depending upon time of a fire alarm or a fire drill, you will either have your cards collected at that time or you will be re-instructed if time permits to come back into the building. <laughs> There's a fire drill. I just feel like it takes the fun out of it if they tell us that it's a fire drill though. Like. This is Ali Bermudez, we went to high school together. Pretty much the coolest person on campus. Cabbage. That's what I need. Recently, I have been eating a ton of junk food. By junk food, I don't mean candy bars and potato chips. I mean generally processed food that looks like it's gone through six factories before it's been placed down in front of me. So in my case today, I had not had any actual greens for probably like a week, which is really embarrassing. And I figured it was about time that I actually eat something that's green. So I went and I bought something green and then I ate it. Uh, obviously I didn't finish it because this is literally the size of my head, but I think I made pretty good headway on it um, I'll have it eaten by by the end of today I worked on a singleness RX. It's like a What would you call it? It's like a drug commercial logo Yeah, uh, yeah, so I designed that that's for the studio 4109 show. That's this weekend I'll put some links in the description below once the video from the show comes out and they're really good so you should check them out down there. Really important to remember to note when clash changes happen. Like this particular time I was ready for my class. I was 10 minutes early sitting in the classroom. Came to be about four minutes before the class is about to start. And, and I said to myself, why is no one in class right now? I realized because class is happening on literally the other side of campus, in the library today. So good news is I have my board. So I can get across campus fairly quickly, but still. I'm gonna be a couple minutes late just because I didn't make a note of that. So make sure you keep track of things like that. Otherwise, it's gonna be really embarrassing. I made it. I hate showing up late for classes. 
I was feeling really gross, so I decided to buy a cabbage and eat the whole thing. It turned out to be one of the worst decisions of this semester. Uh, my stomach hurts right now. Uh, I do not suggest eating raw cabbage. I think I'm gonna try and get a salad or something later today, but I'm gonna go throw this away and yeah. That's disturbing. <laughs> This stuff tastes way better than a cabbage. 